we've just done the tobacco mapacho cleansing I was drinking it and here it is left something that I was I was also sniffing through my nose the way shamans do drinking drinking mapacho is a cleansing cleansing ritual let's see for body for mind for the spirit also if you like like all the plants have their spirits and mapacho has a very unique spirit this is why the amazonian and and Andean shamans use mapacho <coughs> and tobacco. It teaches you things as well. <coughs> Among shamans, they, they treat mapacho as a protector as well and as a healer. So I have I have drunk mapacho. After maybe 20 minutes I started feeling After maybe 10 20 minutes I started feeling weaker and as if my body started to become numb <coughs> and weak. It didn't feel bad, it was quite good. Then I laid it down and I was meditating, I was observing my body, I was sending it sending love to it. I was observing the feeling, the presence of Mapacho, this tobacco, of this spirit. And then this way I, I, I passed, I don't know how many hours, maybe two or three hours. I, it was a beautiful feeling, it was I experienced a lot of peace, complete cessation of mental activity. And all of the time I was I was sending love to my body. I was hearing it. And now my body feels like a temple. And it feels good. After these hours, after this meditation, I had the urge to vomit. As it naturally happens always, I vomited. It was not, it is not painful, it is not hard. And now I feel much stronger within me even though the body is still quite weak I feel good, I feel clear within me I know that um, I would recommend it to everybody this cleansing I also saw that um, if I were to give this ritual ceremony cleansing to somebody I could also work on that person during, while while the person is in that state of cleansing, in that state of weakness, in that state of lying down. I could work on people. So it was very neat. <laughs> and of course you might want to see what is here. Huh? Lake Escaltes. Hmm. He likes warmth. He likes to be close to the body, even though you see that he ha he does not have fingers. He has three nails that are really strong. And when he will be bigger, older, because he's a baby. 
still. Mm -hmm. When he will be older, I think that he can even crush bones or even kill with these nails because they are very strong. They are strong now and in the future I think they will be much stronger. He eats leaves of one tree and he sleeps a lot. Also Perezoso it is called in Spanish. It is like a lazy bear. And as you see he's always taking rest. Let's leave it to take rest. <laughs> <coughs> Small mosquitoes are flying around. In this place. It's very beautiful also. I will be working with people here and you are invited to come in Peru, in the jungle of Peru. Here we are working with the medicinal plants of the jungle and healing people. We work with ayahuasca. I have San Pedro. I have an Apache. So, you are invited to come.